Honestly, I didn't know what to make a video on today, uh, but I wanted to make something. I'm bored out of my mind. Um, so this is my story, pretty much, on dealing with sleep disorders. I know it sounds kind of stupid, but there are people out there who probably do want to watch this, so I thought I'd share my story. I think it was like six months ago, I was diagnosed with sleep apnea. Sleep apnea is where you quit breathing in your sleep. I got a CPAP machine. I wear a nasal, nasal thing. When I got it, I noticed a little bit of a difference. Uh, I have a mild case. I only quit up to 14 times an hour at the most. Time went on, it was just like, you know, this isn't even helping me. For the past four years, uh, I've been completely exhausted. I can't keep up with anyone. I mean, I quit going to friends' houses. I quit trying to socialize. I honestly can't keep up with anyone. The last whole year, it just kind of got worse and worse to the point where I'm falling asleep, you know, randomly. I fell asleep in class twice. I've never fallen asleep in class. I've never fallen asleep in cars. I've started falling asleep in cars. I fall asleep just talking to someone. So I went back to the sleep lab for a third sleep study. I had to take five naps during the day. REM sleep, three out of five naps. And REM sleep is where you're like starting to dream. It's kind of like deep sleep, your body's paralyzed, like you're actually sleeping. And then that's when I like 20 minutes. I was diagnosed with narcolepsy. Now I just took my first pill, like the actual pill to start waking me up. Basically this video is to tell you there is a light at the end of the tunnel. If you feel tired on a daily basis, I completely understand. It feels like no one understands. No one understands the way your body feels. You feel dead. Go to the sleep lab. No sleep studies suck. Um, but it's, it's really worth it. If you feel dead and strong emotions like laughing make you lightheaded or your limbs feel heavy or you just need to sit down like you're going to pass out, you're not alone. Feel that way, get help. It's worth it.